how are you doing so i am back with another Elder beauty face mask so the other day i did the clay cockle mask and today that will be i will be doing is the peel off mask this is a smart skincare solution hydrating glitter peel off face mask has strawberries and champagne in it now i don't know how to feel about this i don't know if this is even halal or not so don't quote me on this if you are not a mufti or somebody who is well known in the religion please do not comment down below if you are unaware and just randomly gonna say it's haram uh, i need actual factual statements from somebody who is well aware um other than that obviously this is not going to my mouth just saying so this is a hyd uh, hydrating hyaluronic acid skin shimmering glitter um other than that this is for dull and dry skin my skin is not, i wouldn't say it's dull but it can lean towards dull, but it's definitely dry. So, um, it is to smooth and hydrate the skin while leaving behind a brighter looking complexion. The hydronic acid helps clean, keeps skin hydrated and plump, peeling, helps remove dead skins and poor buildup. So, um, I did the clay mask one also uh, removes poor buildup. Um, but I'm still going to do it anyways because I am allowed to do it twice a week. Anyways, so keeping that up. Um, so cleanse skin before you. So I rewash my face. And I am going to use a toner around my face. And then go ahead and put this up. Apply this. And then evenly around your skin. Avoid um, getting in your hair, eyes, eyebrows, lips. Allow the mask to set for approximately 20 minutes or until the mask is completely dry. Oftentimes, I will recommend just to let it completely dry instead of just waiting for 20 minutes. And your face feels tightened and toned. Gently peel the mask off, starting from the chin area and working your way up. Rinse with warm water and remove any remaining products. Now, it feels like the clay mask, so um, obviously it doesn't really matter if it goes into the eyebrows, but obviously I won't recommend that. But since this is a peel-off mask, um, obviously you want to stay away from uh, the hairline and um, your eyebrows and just make sure that your hair is moved back away from your hair. Um, it is made in UK. Um, apparently it has no parabens and sulfates um so clearly there's nothing in here that has anything to do with champagne um i'm guess wait hold on let's see a lot of products nowadays have alcohol okay it does have alcohol in it um a lot of products nowadays have alcohol in it um I'm talking about the skincare, not, not the part of eating. A lot of them have alcohol in them to begin with. So just keeping that in mind. Um, so yeah, um, I'm going to apply this, do whatever I need to do, and then I will come back and let you know about the final results. So stay tuned. So I am back. I didn't put any moisturizer on my skin. And, um, or serum. And obviously, um, my skin is, I wouldn't expect it to be like, oh my god, soft as a baby's butt cheeks without the moisturizer and the serum, but um, at least still feel a little bit nice. It, it, it kind of mixture of soft and dry. I don't know how to explain it. It feels extremely dry, but at the same time, it feels like it is kind of soft. Um, I don't know. It's kind of a weird feeling because I actually like the previous one, the charcoal one, charcoal one, the clay mask, and I loved it. This one, I think I would, because I know like your skin needs to be moisturized to make it feel better. Um, why is there hair in the back? Whatever. Uh, but it does feel hydrated though. That's definitely, I will say. Um, it's definitely, I feel like it is hydrated, um, removal of dead skin cells, I didn't see any, but I feel like it still did its job, um, so I think the dryness part, I want to say much, but it definitely feels hydrated, my skin definitely feels hydrated, um, I don't know how to tell poor buildups though. Besides the little roughness that I have under, like, on my cheeks, under my eyes, those are a lot less from Tuesday. So, I guess it did its job. 
So again, everybody's skin type is different. So one thing may work for me, may not work for you. Um, other than that, I will be looking down my Instagram pages down below. Make sure to follow, hit the subscribe button, the bell button. I'll be back for more. Stay safe and stay tuned, guys.